yeah hi we are from SVS Embedded the project title name is RFID and Zigbee based electronic passport verification through IOT and ESP8266 so this is remote website and we are created one database with four four authorized cards and one unauthorized card so we are checking the transmitter to receiver receiver will send the data to das database whether this is this person is authorized person or unauthorized person and the person name person name and passport id date of birth and village district pin code and person area okay so let us coming into the hardware part so rfid and zigbee based electronic passport verification through iot and a transmitter module the distance of the transmitter receiver is 30 meter distance power supply em18 rfid module and zigbee transmitter zigbee receiver it in it is sending the data to adreno board or you can use the raspberry pi pico 16 cross 2 lcd alarm red led green led em18 rfid esp8266 wi-fi module and iot one web page with photo alert there are four rfid cards and one unauthorized card so let us coming into the hardware part so here we are using power supply module bridge rectifier filter capacitor 7805 regulator and one led zigbee transmitter module and consist of em18 rfid module so here we are using adreno uno r3 board zigbee receiver module and 16 cross 2 lc display alarm red led and green led wi-fi module wi-fi hotspot internet required so we are giving the wi-fi hotspot internet through mobile data mobile data and hotspot internet and we are sending the data to one GoDaddy website. So this is transmitter power supply board, bridge rectifier, filter capacitor, 7805 regulator, and one LED. So passport verification system using RFID and Zigbee technology. So it is checking the Wi-Fi hotspot first. Okay, one device connected. Okay, Wi-Fi hotspot module. So now it is checking the Wi-Fi hotspot internet. So uh, Wi-Fi hotspot internet is also connected. So show your authorized card. So first I am going to check the unauthorized with banned person. So unauthorized card, passport not verified. And it is sending the data to server. Sent OK. So this is unauthorized card. Okay, wrong person. And I am getting one email alert also. So, okay email alert wrong passport so passport unauthorized person you can check on the web page okay just once okay so it will show you on the database okay so i am going for one prakash rfid card okay passport verified send data to web page sip mode sending okay yeah here prakash prakash Passport ID, date of birth, Vidyanagar, Nijamabad, PIN code with Telangana. Okay. Okay. So now I am going for the Subhash or Ramesh authorized card. Now I am going to check the Ramesh card. Ramesh passport verified. send data to website and this is Ramesh Ramesh passport ID with date of birth Ramnagar village Rangareddy pin code and everything ok so now I am going to check Prakash Suresh and I am going to check the Suresh card passport verified sending ok sending data yeah suresh 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 passport id date of birth varangal ok prakash suresh and one subhash card subhash 
passport verified okay subash passport passport verified nirmal adilabad pin code so this is iot web page this is remote web page so transmitter mo receiver module and transmitter module transmitter module and zigbee is it is sending the data this, this zigbee module it is receiving the data and sending to arduino board and iot web page it is sending the data to iot website and i am going for unauthorized card passport not verified send red led and alarm on unauthorized card and we will get one email alert also so that a godaddy website it will send the email alert we will receive and go to web page so like this time 4 14 now it's not received but it will receive ramesh and next i will go for qr code scanning same to same everything same to same with qr code yeah ramesh passport qr code sorry uh, village rangareddy nijambad authorized person thanking you if there is any doubt let me know to svs embedded transmitter module receiver module